Did I get out? I think I got out. Hey there guys, MCB here, and today we are going to be playing some Minecraft Pocket Edition Factions. We are here on STCraft PE. I've basically spent the past few hours looking for raids. I got one raid for you guys. I also got some PvP and some crate opening. So, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. All right, so we finally have found a raid. I actually found one before. Apparently there was nothing inside of it. I blew out all the chests up and just nothing came out of it. We're gonna go ahead and do slash homes. And as you can see, I was very excited to find this slash home. Yes, yes, yes. And as you can see, we got some chests inside of there. So we're just gonna creep right into the base because it is, as you can see, bedrock. Hopefully this isn't gonna break any of the chests inside. I don't think it will, but I mean, it is possible, I guess. So we're just gonna have to hope for the best. Ten hits to get in and this is the last one so there we go we are in and none of the chests blew up perfect perfect all right so let's just see there is stuff okay thank god i swear i thought this was gonna be another empty raid uh this is just dusty so i'm not gonna need to take any of that but uh it's it's definitely reassuring to see there's at least some gear inside of this so what we got inside here uh more starter but we'll take the obsidian gladly and we got some mythic boots as well uh nothing in there What's all this? Dusty, rare. Okay, don't need any of that. Oh, perfect. Look at this. We got ton of notch apples. We got some obsidian. I'll take the flint and steel. Uh, mythic elite. I forgot that kit existed. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, yeah, a lot of mythic gear. Uh, is this all mythic? Except the one elite sword, it looks like it. Uh, legendary pickaxe. And I think that's going to be everything. And you know what? We'll just take these spare um and did we check this we did not more notch apples uh, let's go ahead and put away these in our pv we got more notch apples here not gonna take the crapples though uh emperor gear and you know what i guess we'll take it why not um we could take the mythic pickaxe and repair it but i don't really need it i've already got a fair amount of pickaxes take the rest of the obsidian and that's all for the stuff on the sides here so let's go ahead and put these away there we are. So now we need to check these ground chests that are kind of sort of hidden. I don't know whether that's intentional or what. Hopefully these are actually being used. It doesn't look like there's anything in any of those. What do we got in these floor chests though? Maybe there will be something good in these. I don't know. Okay, there we go. Notch apples. I'll take it. Uh, rare set. Don't really need that, but we will take the obsidian. Uh, starter legs. Not going to need those. Okay, uh, Zeus gear, we'll take that, absolutely. These are two separate chests. I guess that got screwed up, and I think that's everything. So I could probably close this up and then set a home here, um, and maybe he would, you know, continue to use it. But I don't really think I need to do that. So all I'm going to do here is do slash set home inside raid one. And hopefully if this ever gets patched, you know what? No, we've got plenty of bedrock. Let's just patch it up. We might as well. Let's be nice for him because we don't want anybody else to uh, come and take this from us. So just in case he does decide to use this again and I guess doesn't notice that we already raided him, let's just go ahead and do that. And now it's like we were never even there. But there we go. Definitely a good first raid on ST Craft. I'm still going to look for one more. Hopefully we can get another one before the end of the video. But I've been searching for like five hours. So not really sure whether that's going to be very likely. So that's going to be it for the rating. Let's get into the other clips. What is going on? You got in a wither mask. <laughs> this, this random guy's just flying. I feel like one of them is going to pro to me and try to kill me. So I'm uh, trying to be very cautious here. We got some gear down here that I will gladly take. I lost the head, so I'm going to go ahead and just eat. I think I picked that up. I did. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's sell that. I don't know whether it's actually worth anything, but we could get some free money off of it. So, slash head sell. There we go. Uh, $12,000. Not much, but at least it's something. Oh, we got another one. What is this guy doing? Oh, hi. No, 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 no. I'm out. Okay. Be that way. You're literally fly PvPing, bro. He's 
These kids, look at them. No! Did I get out? I think I got out. Oh my gosh, these guys were such blatant fly PVPers, dude. I think I got out of combat there. Okay, so I've learned now- Oh, what? I'll take the bedrock. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I've learned that people are not very good at PvP, but they're definitely very sweaty. Uh, you saw that clip. That was- I was not expecting that to be- you know, a thing that happened. I was just trying to fight some people like normally, just get some uh, some normal uh, gameplay in. But I mean, hey, we got out. We pulled a very nice play out of that. Our gear has definitely taken a beating though. So we're gonna go ahead and slash repair all this. All right, so unfortunately due to those guys camping me spawn PVP, I can't really get any PVP clips for you, which is what I was planning to do. Um, and I've looked for raids. It's been like literally five hours and I've only gotten that one sky base raid and the failed claimed raid. So what we're gonna be doing instead is opening up some crates. As you can see, we've got ourselves some legendary and mythic crates, and these are actually spread across multiple vaults. So you'll see how much we have once we're finished. And there we go, look at all these. We got 19 mythic relics, six legendary relics, and a special relic. And we might even have some keys that I haven't opened up yet. Uh, let's see, dusty, rare, mythic, okay, we have one legendary, so start with the legendary crate, and hopefully we can get something out of this, I like the lava, it's a very nice touch, 96 blocks of gold, and a 1 million dollar check, that's very nice, I very much appreciate that, let's go ahead and claim that, and we will sell this gold as well, slash sell all, it also looks like we got an overlord kit out of that, very, very nice, these actually sell for quite a lot of money, so let's go ahead and open up, uh, let's see, how about the mythic relics first? These are probably the more simple ones, so let's see. Just open these, and we got a ton of stuff. And we got a ton of mythic gear, as you can see, so we're just gonna go ahead and put this all in our PBs. We've also got the legendary relics, so let's go ahead and open up all of these. And we've got a ton of gold, we're gonna go ahead and sell all of that. We got some iron, gonna sell all of that. And we got some diamonds, sell all of that. So we are currently up to about 1.5 million and we were pretty much broke at the start of this. And lastly, we have our special relic. I've never actually opened one of these up before. I don't know what's inside of them. I actually got it because I was in my base and I was mining the uh, Prismarine from the Machine 5000 Inator. I just got a special relic out of it. So I have no clue what I'm gonna get out of this, but we're gonna place it down and hope for the best. All right, we got some good stuff. Toxic tag and gold blocks. All right, so let's go ahead and sell all this gold first. Now we have a toxic tag. I'm not sure how much these actually sell for. So unfortunately, as I already have the toxic tag, I don't really need this, but if they bring back the auction house, we can definitely sell this for a bit of money. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the other chest, which is down here. And I think there's actually another toxic tag in one of these. And there we go. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. It would be very much appreciated. Uh, more rating and hopefully PvP in the next video. And you might even see a cameo from Adrian. We'll have to see about that. Anyways, I will see you all in my next episode of ST Craft Pocket Edition Factions. Peace.